and welcome back to today. Isabel and I, we are going to be doing an unboxing for BoxyCharm. BoxyCharm And also, I, no it's not, it's actually one of my favorite subscriptions. But also, I know what you guys are gonna say, whatever I do is not gonna look good with this orange shirt. But oh well, okay, I already know this. I don't like the color orange, it's just, uh, Jaden has a game today, so uh, I have to wear this. This is his team collar and it also says uh, Jaden's mom on the back and his number six so let's go ahead and open this box and see what's inside so here's the box let's go ahead and open it up and get a good look uh, here is everything that's inside this time this says box of charm they changed the card which I think is super cute look at this it folds out like this and um we're gonna go through everything that was in this box this time and here's the first look i am super excited to get into all of this stuff so let's go ahead and get started so the first thing in this box that i'm gonna try this is the porn and more by dr brant it is a vacuum yeah. cleaner this is a mask so i'm gonna go ahead and jump up there to future sarah and try it out okay so i just went and took a bath and i'm ready to apply this mask this is the uh dr brant vacuum cleaner pore purifying mask it says after cleaning apply a thin layer to areas of concern avoid eyes leave on five to ten minutes until dry a cooling sensation will occur rinse with warm water and pat dry use two to three times per week for maximum results i'm sorry my kids are being allowed they're always loud. you guys are used to it so let's go ahead and open this up this is like ooh. It has like little tiny uh, bluish beads in it. So let's go ahead and put this everywhere on my face. Ew, it feels like jelly. That smells horrible. Okay, it's completely on my face. I'm gonna let it dry. I'm not a fan of the way it smells. It literally smells like burnt hair, if that makes sense. But I love Dr. Brent's products. I have a few products that I use. I use the primer and I use the face wash. So I'm gonna give this a chance. It might just smell bad. Uh, so far, I don't have the cooling sensation yet and it's not bothering my skin, but the smell is awful. So I'm going to leave this on, rinse my face off and I'll come back for my final thoughts. Okay, I wanted to give you guys a look of what it looks like when it dries it's like kind of got a bluish uh white kind of look to it when it dries so uh this is what it looks like i'm actually about to take it off so far no burning uh not much of a cooling sensation but um yeah okay so i just took it off my face and my face feels like super super clean now i'm getting the kind of like the cooling mint feel that it said it was i was gonna get on the bottle but yeah like my face feels super clean i'll probably put this in my uh face mask rotation because one i'm really cheap and um I got it in my box, so I want to use it. And two, um, I love Dr. Brandt products. I'm just saying. The only thing I have to say negatively about it is that it smells like burnt hair. Uh, the smell is awful, but other than that, um, I, I don't care. I'm like at all at how pretty clean it made my face. My face looks really good. So um, on with the rest of the video. Ah! So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, but also this right here is uh, $47. So that's a little pricey. I'm yeah. So uh, next thing in the box, it's this element of surprise. I'm the ones you don't want. It's this element of surprise. It is an eyeshadow palette. This right here is uh, $16. Is by ColourPop. Um, I actually really do love the colors in this. I, it was either between, because you got to, it, there was a bunch of different palettes they were like given out. It was between this one and the My Little Pony one that I really, really wanted. But uh, look how pretty these colors are. I'm gonna try the pink one. You will, don't worry. And I'm sorry guys if my uh, camera angles are a little off. I'm just getting used to this new camera. So I'm gonna go ahead and swatch these for you and I'll be back. Okay, so here are all the swatches. I am absolutely in love with this palette. I cannot wait to just dive right in and do an eye look. I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. So I went ahead and get off of this. Off camera, I went ahead and put my primer on my eye and the eyeshadow that is set for the base because this one doesn't really have a light enough color for me. This one doesn't have a light enough color, so what I'm gonna go in with first, a plain, I think that's what it is. It's this pink right here. Sorry, still I'm getting used to this camera. It's this pink right here. Hush, and I'm gonna just put it all over my eye. Quiet, I'm gonna do her first because if I don't, she's gonna go crazy. Okay, look at me, bud. This is super pink. Close. Keep them close. Ooh, that is so pretty on you. Ready? Close. Don't scrunch the eyes up. Relax them. Look at, look at 
at yourself. You're so pretty. Okay, now I'm gonna be me. That is so like super de duper bright. I'm literally going crazy with this look, so. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with a smaller brush and uh, go in with the color like canvas. Is that right? I think that's looking really good. Okay, I'm going to go in with Silk, silk Street now. And just in the corners, I want to darken that up just a little bit. Yeah, so now I'm going to cut out a crease so I can put my next color on. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the shade Subdue. It's this purple right here. Okay, I'm gonna go and back in with this brush and just put a little more of the Silk Street to blend everything together. Okay, I'm gonna do the exact same thing to the next eye, and uh, I'm gonna do the exact same thing to the next eye, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put the rest of my eye makeup on and my foundation and stuff, and then I'll be back. Okay, so um, I finished my eye look. I also put foundation on. I am absolutely loving, loving this eyeshadow. Like, it's literally giving me like um, unicorn, mermaid, like super bubblegum popcorn feel. I absolutely love it. So the next thing in the box, this is a Tarte part. Heart Pro Glow. Uh, this is in the shade Stunner. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. This is a highlighter. Uh, this is also $29. So this, this is pretty expensive. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it on my arm. So you guys can see that before I put it on my face. I'm gonna have to use a very, very gentle hand with this because look at that. That is amazing. I cannot, I cannot wait to put this on my face. Okay. This is some super powerful stuff. I'm loving that. This is absolutely beautiful. Like, I can't with how beautiful this is. Okay, so next, last but not least, this is a DC's High Definition Liquid Lipstick. I think. I'm saying this right. If I'm not, I'm so sorry. I'm horrible with names. So let's go ahead and get this out and look at it. I love these thick tubes. I don't know why. I just feel like I'm getting more product for the dollar. This is $24. And there's the brush. I love the brushes when they look like this. And I'm gonna swatch it for you guys. Ooh, this is dark. I like this. I really do. I like that. I like dark brown. So this might actually not go with my look today, but it's okay. I'm taking some of my lip oil off. I'm gonna go ahead and put this. Oh. That is gorgeous. I love this color. It really doesn't match my look right now. Yes, I will definitely use this in the future. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do now is I'm gonna finish putting on the rest of my look. I'm gonna put on blush and bronzer and my eyebrows and then I'll be back for my final thoughts in my final look. Hey, I almost forgot about one product. Uh, this right here is a uh, brow gel. This is $22. This is by, it says the brow, the brow gel. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on my eyebrows and 
put this through there. I honestly can't believe I almost forgot that. I'm not sure if this is my collar. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't think this is my collar. I think I needed a little bit more of a darker collar. I don't know. What do you guys think? Tell me down in the comments below what do you guys think. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put my blush and my uh, bronzer on and then I'll be back for my final thoughts and final look. So here's my final look and yes, I'm gonna look extremely extra at Jaden's game today. I'm probably gonna turn some heads, but oh well. Uh, they can get over it. I don't care. But, um, yeah, I really, 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 really enjoyed everything in this box this time. I'm still not sure about the brow gel. I'm gonna have to use it a couple times and play with it to actually get a, uh, good sense of if I like it or not. So stay tuned to, like, um, a family vlog. I'll give you guys an update. But, um, thank you for watching. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I put out new videos every Monday and Thursday. Also, make sure you have the little bell on because a lot of people are not getting my notifications. And, uh, you guys are missing out. These videos are great. So, um, also, I have been going live and I've been doing some makeup videos and gaming videos. You can find the times for that on my Twitter and in my Instagram. And also, I've been doing a lot of Instagram stories lately and everybody's been loving those. So, follow me on there if you haven't. And if you want to see more of me and my family when I'm not live, when I'm not doing videos, you can find me on my Snapchat, Twitter, and Instagram. All the links for that are just down in the description below. And, uh, thanks for watching this video. And until next time, 